Tactics reject stifle, discard like paper balls. Their cries were held muffled, who can hear their calls? Let me tell you the story of one such misfit, a poor girl from a loving family entrenched in the shadows of poverty. She wanted to raise them up, erase their suffering, so she chose to study, standing up in tattered clothes. But her classmates, sneaky, sinister, and in groups of five, stabbed her with snide words like knives. Look at her, she's a disaster. They circled around her, pounced at her like wild wolves. You just don't belong here. Cool, filth, scum, rot, names, 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 like bullets from a firing squad, just labels, help your tears, show no fear, stand up for yourself, her friends say, not knowing that she's struggling not to drown with how many times she's been shot down, that she gets altitude sickness, just trying to stand up. Her mind rages like a storm unbound. I welcome guests enter her mind, but she just bottles them, pretending that she didn't at all mind. Her wounds festered, her demons fed, her spirits crushed like the dead, dead night. Stand up, Mr. Teacher says. Every time their excuses were the same. We're just playing around, aren't we, friend? She could do nothing but to stand down. And the rest of them, who had witnessed in horror, turned a blind eye, perhaps gave a pitying sigh, not wishing to get involved. Now flip the case, stop that, a boy said, challenging the wolves, their words of hate, altering the girl's cruel fate. Another kind soul used her ear instead and listened to the poor girl while she spilled and spilled the mess of feelings from messier bottles like monsters out of cages, roaring, screaming, noisy, ugly. And yet, the poor girl finally found a friend who stuck by and lent a hand. No advice needed, no opinion given, just someone there to listen. This is how you stand up. And now, she doesn't have to stand up alone. With new allies, she's no longer a lonesome soldier in the, this battlefield called school, filled with armed youths, with bullets called words. Stand down. If you have nothing kind to say, let someone else speak and tell their story. Listen close and let it touch you in the innermost. So you can be a voice of change, converting your school from a shooting range to what it's supposed to be, a garden of growth, of self-discovery. Together as one, we can raise our fallen allies, help them stand up when they cannot alone, and oppose the cruel bullies, defend the innocent, shun sitting on the fence, for how can one stay neutral when it helps the oppressor and never the tormented? Stand up. Thank you.